Aha, we have 1250 Underworld in our next game. Winner takes all. Right. <clears throat> okay. First of all, let's have a quick look at my team for the YouTube. So this is Chaos vs Underworld, and this is about match 15, I think. Uh, this is my team. Uh, we've now got Logix, the Agility 4 Goat back, who's got Wrestle. Um, we do have a Tackle player, which is uh, can be exciting in this game. And Polyopsis is nearly at 51 points, so Polyopsis is absolutely the right elf. Uh, opposing team we have spun in two. I don't know, let's have a look. Uh, Dalibor and his, oh my god, 16 2 3. This is not going to be very nice. 16 2 3 uh, Underworld. Uh, he's got a Claw Mighty Blow, so he's got the same as me. Got an extra guard, same as me, so he's got one more guard. And he is going to have. Oh, doesn't. Okay. Right, over to him. Right, we're going to open the giveaway now. So, open giveaway. I don't know how long it's going to run for. Um, we'll leave it open for a while. Um, quite a long time by the looks of things. So, you are now welcome to join the giveaway to collect a free Andy Davo and Zunk miniature. Um, so far, we've got more player Machina, G Jimmy, um, YN Carney, Black Swan, Jubstep, Sick as Eggs, Scary Terry, Scorpion, uh, Legion, Star Ferret, Raven, um, Gudo Shaftle something. Uh, oh, these names, you guys. Uh, Striker, Diggity John, Bioma, Rightful, Cheeky Jimmy, uh, Arcani, uh, Hell's Angel, Rugbar, and Hellboy have joined so far. I have re re uh, read your name out. You have successfully joined. You can only join once as well. Doesn't it be. Um... Uh, Crab Boom was the last person to join. Uh, Ardvax joined. Mordecai, Jack Ball, James Jenks. Um, well done, you're all in. Uh, right, we're going to go on offense here. What inducements did he pick? Uh, two star players. So he's got Skitter, Annoying Stab, uh, and Glaf. Yeah, full of sense. Okay. Right, way to deal with this game is going to be very similar to the last time we played Underworld, which is deal with the dangerous ones, um, slow 2-1 grind it, uh, and see what happens. We don't need to go crazy. Um, we just need to play this slow and steady uh, and grind down the field. Um, any removals is great, um, and I really do wish we had piling on because then we can uh, really ramp up the uh, the damage output. Uh, start ferret, Zunk doesn't count. You can't join Zunk. So while that's all working through, uh, next thing is Rick has done a um, another one of his wonderful podcasts. Uh, last week he had uh, another daytime streamer on, um, and that was quite entertaining. This week he had me on, um, so I would check that out. Um, Rick, I'm sure, will link his YouTube channel um, and or the actual video himself as soon as it's up and uh, up and running. So uh, you should you should enjoy that. Um, I enjoyed having him on. I'm well, sorry, I enjoyed. Him having me on whatever um, I was on Rick's show and it's quite fun um, so uh, there was that next week there will be Zunk on there so look at you everywhere I know I know um, so that was that was good fun yeah it was good it was it was I, I enjoyed it it was good being on Rick's show um, or his real podcast he's got Zunk on next week and then I'm not sure he's got on Rick will probably tell you all more about it um, not only have I been on Rick's thing, I've also been on Broadsword's thing. So if you want to um, see how coaching has improved someone's life, um, Broadsword will link his video now, I hope. So Rick got a free coaching session from me as well. Um, no, Rick and I just talked. Um, Broadsword uh, had a couple of uh, sessions. That was good. Right, so anyway, back over to this. Back onto the Blood Bowl. Now we've got three dice there. Right, you need to come face the ball. Oh, you're on 14. So he's got sidestep, so I'm only going to get two hits on both of these. Uh, sorry, one hit on both of these, so we need to make sure this is three dice. Um, the question should be probably should I make this uh, with tackle? And the answer is probably yes. So, um, you there, you there. 
Thank God you did. Uh, uh, and then know that we're going to be blitzing with you. Um, yeah. Okay. So we've got. That'll do. All right. Hey there. Nice team. <laughs> Two matches we played before, um, I've reviewed his team. Good! Let's see if we can do it again. Green Kichi. Got fame. Okay, well, his first player survived. Interesting to see where he sidesteps to here. Um, I don't know if he's in chat, so we'll wait until this plays through. Um, what I think you guys could be thinking about is how who sh who should I be wanting to blitz with this guy, um, and and how would you make that be a thing? You make that three dice. I know where he's going to go. Competent enough to do what I think I would not want to do. A both down hit result here would be. Good. Right, we're going to go after the, uh, the, the troll. Went to the guard in there. And then I can have two dice on the troll. It doesn't have block, it does have blood mighty blow. Just do that. Wish it's busy. Ooh. No. We'll push him away, we'll push him away. Don't follow up. Oh, that's nice. Good start. One of the two claws have gone. It failed to regen. And uh, it's one of his two guard as well. So, do need to hide you. We did like driving. I'm going to watch it at the end. I am not going to watch it beforehand. Um, I don't want to watch it during the stream, but I, I will. It's going to be a question, but are the teams like Underworld even viable considering how many below average units they have? Um, or are they just for funsies? So, Damask, uh, it's a great question. And I think um, Global intrinsically is not quite all level. Um, so Chaos are one of the premier tier 1 teams, however they're only premier tier 1 at super duper high team value. Below below sort of 1500 TV, they are not great, they're okay. Um, so yeah, they, they absolutely can work. Um, and Underworld, this matchup is not as, as one sided as you might believe because um, I don't have uh, the kill skills to deal with him, and he got some inducements. Um, you know, which one of the two teams would I rather be playing? Prob probably mine, but it's only 60-40 my favour rather than you know a, a monstrous amount my favour. And the Underworld do have the, they have the tools and abilities to really screw me over. So, it's not, it's not a done deal. Um, what the Underworld have was a problem is they can make you <coughs> excuse me they can implode they could just go and if they do that they look terrible but they probably only implode one game in ten if I spoiling people's since 1992 um I don't think it was 192 I think it was more like 89 
interesting to see what he chooses to do now. Um, and he is starting to spread out. And the idea of the reason he's spreading out is because he's trying to avoid um, my, I would say my guard. Yeah, my guard player. Uh, but, you know, he's trying to spread out so he doesn't um, get faced up too easily. Um, and the storm bow in here um, is, is a problem. This one is a problem he needs dealing with. I have to do something about this. Okay. So many tempting targets. Which one do I hate most? Let's put tackle on both of those. I think I hate that one most. I think. Is it's guard. It, unlo it unlocks him to be able to do stuff. It, unlo it unlocks his ability to do stuff. I think, I think we're going to deal with him. Middle. This is very, very, very flat line here. Very flat. Down. Up. Right, so that's both guards out. Next two are the uh, the two claws. Once they've gone, then this team probably starts folding like a little cardboard hat. Guard next to the claw. Two, three, four. Will do. Tackle on these guys. If he wants to push him in, he won't get him back out again. So presumably he's going to blitz Ron. We might. Um, how long will the giveaway be open? I would love to be here when it's closed. Um, I think we're going to leave it open for a while. Um, in fact, we should actually put it into the stream tile. Hello, Andy. Um, So he did indeed blitz Ron. There we go. Um, new question, can you see the giveaway details somewhere? Uh oh. Let's carry that. Now down to 11. Problem? Um, mm, yeah, go on then, I'll set up a link to it. There you go. That's what you'll get if um, it all works. Right, uh, well, it's Glart next, isn't it? Can't make this lots of dice, so let's not try. Stay, stay, com stay compressed. Everyone gets to follow as a big unit this this game. Oh yeah. Make the ball safe. Oops. I think you can't. 
Hit the ball, save. But this this turn we only get to base a couple of players, which is a shame. Die, Glart. Shame. Well, he's stunned though. You get to go there. Fold, fold around the side. There we go. Um, does it appear somewhere in the Twitch GUI? Jimmy, what do you mean? Type the giveaway type 0898 Andy. Um, I was that's a, a reference of um, get your free Andy here 0898 Andy. That's it's the the phone line reference. I thought it was a, it was a good it's a good thing. Uh, as in it should show in the giveaway. <laughs> it did make you chuckle. Good, rightful, good. That was the idea. Um, when I get towards the end of the giveaway, with if, sort of five minutes left, I'll read out everyone who's joined. So um, we'll run it. For, we'll run it for at least this game and probably next game to give a maximum amount of people um, the opportunity to join. Oh, well, you're not getting that blitzer back. Better to dodge afterwards. Maybe you are prepared to dodge. Who knows? I think I remember this guy. This guy, didn't he play... Um, he's played Dark Elves and I smashed him off the park. And he's played Vampires and he got very cross when I smashed him off the park. I'm going to convert my Andy Vigo with a witch up. Good. This guy is a slow guy. I don't mind him being slow. Fine, 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 I don't mind. We are going to have another go at, at this guy. I'm going to step forward. I want a warrior there. Blitz there. Right out. Okay, so... You're going in there to put tackle on that. Die. No point following up, so don't. Actually, roll a pal. But you want to sidestep too. time we start started to stop him start to stop um started to not make it so he can just dodge away and be annoying because he is clearly just trying to be annoying here that's a single go for it do i want to let him have a free stab on i don't think i want to let him have a free stab going to go with the go for it, with a warrior because the warrior can go there um, and that's pretty tasty go there and that's free assist you can't easily cancel it this is going all right the casualty damage output has slowed down somewhat but it's still going all right um, and we want to focus on the star players and this guy because they don't have the star players don't have an apothecary so red cross is they're dead um and the scaling blitzer is the is the damage output of the team the rest of it 
It's all cannon fodder. Don't care about it. Um, what is uh, Dally Ball's win rate? Oh, wow. That's good. 71.9. Um, has he played 100 games with him as well? Bless him. A lot of games. Next up. Yeah, I want to start compressing him next. Really want to start bullying him. I don't think I'm doing a good enough job of bullying him. My right, two dice. Good. He's not blitzing the claw might blow. If blitz my claw, that would have gone through. Presumably he's going to dodge another player away and try and block like an extra block here, uh, which is fine because we can then just compress into that. Um, we need to try and make sure that Razzle gets the ball at some point in the next couple of turns because he's the guy that's going to score. That's a shame. Ugh, that's a shame. I don't think he's got anything to foul with, though. It does mean our blitz next turn to cram. Oh, fuck off! <laughs> oh, that's really irritating. Shit goblin causing casualty. That's annoying. I don't really care that they take ages. It's not a a problem. People want to play slowly. That's fine with me. I think two minute turns is already quick enough, right? I don't think it's a problem if people want to play in inverted commas slowly. Um, can I get three to oh. Lol, that's really annoying. We can go there. Turn five, I think we're we're ready to hand the ball off now. Razzle we're gonna hand the ball off. We're gonna blitz there. So you're going to have the ball handed to you. Blitz. Going one, two, three. Blitz. Uh, got leader, so it's not terrible to take it out. Stay that would be nice. Razzle would, would level if he scores and would get guard. Uh, that would give me two guard warriors. And we are just starting to find the, the, the balance point here that not having any guard or only having the one is causing me a problem. Uh, it would be massively helpful if we could get this warrior to guard and then I'll focus on getting this guy straight up to block guard. Um, Bellewa is one of the main arguments. CCL went down for two minutes to three minutes. Um... No, the main no no no, Vili. The main argument people moved CCL from three minutes to two minutes is because they want arcade style fast games. Um, that's just because people are slow. There's plenty of people who can knock out a turn in thirty seconds. And if you're saying that the entire league structure was moved because one person was slow, well, we shouldn't have moved it then, should we?
And not everyone has to play this guy one, uh, all the time. Yeah, One person plays this guy at a time. Um, yeah, Wolfrang, very good, thank you. Um, we've got a, a giveaway open. Do join the giveaway, Wolfrang. You might well uh, pick up a free Andy Davo and Zunk. Um, um, no, people people were getting over what they wanted. Let's let's be clear. Loads of people who were very influential wanted two minute turns because they want to mash out loads of games, and that they can play on semi autopilot most of the time, um, and knock out two minute turns. I can knock out a turn in two minutes, it's fine. But the one time in 20 that I want the third minute would when I take it would be really helpful. So yeah, let, let's let's make sure that we are talking about the same thing here, which is the the excuse for changing it from three to two is a load of bollocks, if you're using that as an example. Sit. Do I need to back off? Stun changes everything. Wolf ranks probably. This. Problem is with the with the lack of players that I've lost. What have we lost? Two, three. Lost three. Um, it's starting to create gaps and it's letting his sniper pick off whatever he wants to pick off. You can't move you, can't move. He's gonna to get to pick whatever he wants to hit next turn. Is that what a fuck all I feel about it? Sorry, I knew you're wrong. No, 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 no. People, the majority of people wanted to move it because they want to play arcade style blood ball. That, that's. They then went and looked for reasons, like Dally Ball, that supported that reasoning. Legitimate. And I'm not saying playing him is not annoying. He went into this good first half of the time. I'm, I'm not saying playing him is not annoying. Um, but which is the lesser of the two evils. Um, playing him once a month and having one game run over or not being able to find the, the complicated clever stuff because you've never got the time to look for it. For me, the more annoying one of the two is not being able to have the three minutes when I want it. Oh, my hell. I'm sure I will. I'm, I am absolutely certain. I mean, and it's a, it's a dead argument. Are they ever going to change it back? No. Is it a completely pointless conversation? Yes. Why have I engaged in it? I don't know. Would I be happier if they changed it back? Yes. Are they going to? No. Etc. Yeah, it, it's circular. It just goes round and round and round and round. <clears throat> reason with the games so BB3 can code it differently. Oh Wags, I'd love to see Blood Bowl 3 coded differently. Um absolutely, completely, yes please. Would love to see it coded differently. That would get my vote all day long. Oops. 
Yeah, you can go in there. You can go in. Oh, nice wall of chaos. Um, you haven't mulled enough of his team here. I know. I'm trying though. Uh, Taps a better coach. And the, the best way to solve that, if you're really going to play at tabletop, for example, James, um, just play with a chess clock. Chess clock. And I'm, I am actually a firm believer that all tournament blah bowl and you go to a tabletop tournament. Oh, that's annoying. Um, all tabletop tournament blah bowl should be played with a chess clock. You should be both given an hour, knock yourself out. I think, Scorpion, I think you need to play at a speed that suits you. Um, I agree, chess clocks with best. Yes. And and honestly, the people who get all anxious about being on a chess clock, that's fine. You just need to play. Remember, you just need to stop stealing someone else's time. Because I play ton when I play at club tabletop tournaments, the number of times that I play against someone who steals my time... I put them in really complicated zips, uh, situations and they freak out and they don't know how to solve it or they take ages solving it and then I have to rush my turns because otherwise we get called on time. It's not me being slow, it's them because of what I've done to them. Casual two dice on, uh, on him. I would be a vast. I, I, I would like to suggest gloves. Um. Yeah. I mean, Chubbers. Let's let's also remember that. In I, I understand. So, I think it's a great it's a great conversation point. Um. Did I get my KO back? Yes, I did. Good. Um, if you could have a chess clock in Blood Bowl, would you would you use it? Oh shit! Now, let's think this through. Um, he hasn't got a troll, so how is he going to one turn? He's going to one turn by trying to shove someone. Um, he's got how many players? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. He has comfortably got enough. So Skitter Stab Runner um, is the way that you do it, and he's also got two-headed goblins to fill in. Crappy, annoying squares. So, um, we have to be really careful here. And we know that the gutter runner needs to be in this rank of play, this rank of squares to do stuff. So, I don't want to give him the three squares behind just to fill stuff in. If you go there, what's he going to do? He's going to blitz into here because he creates a box, pushes there, fills in them squares, he pushes there. Oh, yeah. Guard goes right at the back, just really annoying. Oh, those. I think this is... Pop them around because that strength four is slightly harder to move. Which runner is going to come out this way, or he's going to come out this way? So having the agility guy there is, makes makes a lot of sense. Um, can't go any wider. I'll do. Let's do it. Um, Jack Wall says, if two minute turns on PC are working pretty well, why change it? Uh, well, that's the contentious point, Jack. Um, I don't think either three minutes or two minutes were perfect at either either way round. That was the that's the point. So I'm an advocate of three minute turns. And I but and I think fair's fair, I completely agree that some people then abuse that privilege of three minute turns and play too bloody slowly. 
Um, and it's annoying when certain coaches do it every single time. So, like, I would like the three minutes for the turns that are really complicated and really interesting, which happen once a game, maybe? Maybe? Um, so the correct solution, the solution I would love them to implement is two minute turns with a time bank and you get given maybe five minutes of time bank. So on the occasion that you need it, it's there for you. you don't need it, you don't use it. Um, and I'm pretty sure that both sides of the argument, the two minute people and the three minute people would both say, yay, what a good idea. Um, but unfortunately, Blood Bowl 2 in the way it's currently coded, that's not possible. Um, so we are hopeful that when Blood Bowl 3 is written, coded, this is a thing that they can put in from the ground up. Um, vote before the game if we want. Three minute time or maybe two minutes is the default. Um, yes, and Blood Bowl 1 handled it because the way that Blood Bowl 1 did it was that you could search for matchmaking games um, with variable timers. So you could have uh, 40 seconds, I think there was three, there was 40 seconds, two minutes and four minutes. So you only spun at a time limit that suited you. Um, which I think is quite cute. The problem with that is that um, you would then dilute the player base, so you would have to get rid of the open ladder, um, which I don't think is a problem with that either. I think I would solve this by going, there is only one public matchmaking ladder. It is the champion ladder. Uh, it is properly admined. Um, and, oh, it's not one of mine. Die. Oh, it's the Agility 4 Goblin as well. Nice. Uh, that's bad. That saved him about four dice rolls. <laughs> How about an initial time exception? So each player gets possibly to extend one or two turns per half. Press for two minutes. Yeah, Bioma, absolutely. A time bank. Yes. That is exactly what I am. I and a lot of other people would like to see. Um, how about three minutes and the clock doesn't stop? Uh, if you're going to do that, put it at four minutes and the clock doesn't stop. But you're back to the same problem, which is um, you haven't created a time bank solution. You've just created um, other stuff. He's managed to jangle himself through. Need to push here. Uh, so you push him there, then you've got a T-shape, which is a problem with the second bit of the T-shape. Oh no, oh no, he's actually solved this. He needs two pushes. They probably only need chaos lunchtime, yeah. If only you understood the mechanics of one turning, uh, Dalibor. Um... Right, for no offence, champions are isn't meant to be for new coaches. Um, I think that's an interesting thing to say, that it's not meant for new coaches. Um, I think the best way to get coaches to play is just to make them all be in one pot. Was he in the wrong square? Possibly. Annoying two-headed goblin. Problem with the stuff around the back. Is it... I think he should just go for it. I don't think he will. I think he'll carry on. So, anyway, back to the ch back to um, chess clocks for tabletop. Um, would anyone who is thinking about playing tabletop, um, would chess clocks put them off? Oh, that's unfortunate. Um, it would put you on. <laughs> it turned Hancock on from a chess clock. Good. No. How did it work with turnovers? So I, I'll answer super. I'll ask that. I'll answer that question next. Um, or let me let me give you my thoughts on it. Anyway, um, I am not going to paint myself as the oracle here. 
Um, Now, I think the Frenzy Goat kind of needs to be in the middle, right? <laughs> he's complaining. I suspect he's complaining. Um, okay. There we go. Oh, and the KO stayed out. That's lovely, isn't it? Oh, that's... Uh, one reroll for Dalibor. I'd rather play with one. So, right, so normally normally with a chess clock, um, if you imagine you're going into a tournament, and normally the tournament gives you 2 hours 15 minutes um, to get your game result done. So let's say you give each, each coach an hour. Um, and then you have, um, if it's your turn, you have yeah, an hour. If you, it's their turn, you have an hour. And then set up and, and stuff is just not considered uh, part of the timing. You could if you wanted to, so I split it into one minute, seven minutes each. Um, and then your setup is part of the time. Um, but then you get into a little bit of rule, you know, a little bit regimented. I think the best way that it would work would be to let... Um, it's a guide. Treat the chess clock as a guide. Once you've used your hour, um, maybe you can have another five minutes grace. Um, but play, try and play, try and play to it as much as possible. I think that's the most important thing to do here. Um, off the vent, doesn't he? Yes. Um, uh, when is the giveaway and how do I join? Um, <laughs> yeah, I didn't. I didn't pick the easiest giveaway. I think it's exclamation mark oh eight nine eight Andy one. I think is the way you join. I think. Um, Super will tell you. Play War Machine at a high level. War Machine looks really good fun. Uh, yeah, Kinroth, it's that, but then you have to type one afterwards. Oh, Blitz. That's a shame. Um, what are we going to Blitz, though? What are we going to... Oh, really? Oh, I can Blitz that out. If I Blitz that, and really shut down the line of scrimmage blocks. Let's do that. You can go there. And we know we also know that the ball is not being scored, you know, not being scored on next turn. Guard him out. We don't like to pressure on him. Can I put the pressure on him? I think we've got a blitz. Change my mind. You're going there. You're going there. Going there. I mean, three dice on the goblin. The strength five is going to mark this guy out. One for one. Because that stops the annoying twat blitzing. There, put you there. So then you can't put an assist in. If I if I'd assume straightforward, he'd put his player in that. He blitz on one dice. I'd have looked stupid. So now he's tagged out. This is guarded, um, and he's got to one dice block with Glart if he wants to start anything up this turn. So I think the op his opening is going to have to be a one dice block with a loner. What a lovely thing that is. Those of you who are wondering what the giveaway is going to entail, uh, it's a free Andy Davo and Zunk figurine made by um, uh, Rebo Games, of which the link to that is here. Um, I do warn you, although, however, you will have to pay for the postage and packaging. Um, 
but it will also entitle you to a 10% discount on anything you buy from Grebo Games um, while you're there. What? Yes. PMP is not included. Uh, depending on where you live, it will be between 5 and $10. Um, however, the postage and packaging means that your miniatures will turn up in perfect condition. Shifting the goalposts. Nah, being open and honest before. Oh, he's failed his dodge. Can't re-roll it. So. We shall now send our agility goat forwards. Feel as though we should smash Glot in the. F Sounds good. All right, Glottykins. This is a turn I'm looking maybe to try and put a lot of pressure on uh, the Skaven here. Um, and maybe we can. Uh, whoops. Uh, maybe we can cause some actual lateral damage here. Else out. So that's three dice on that goblin, and then we've got three dice on the other goblin. Lock. On. Well worth picking the goblins off because when you pick goblins off, he then runs out of players, and his his choices to do anything are then so limited. Let's not have Glot blitzing this guy. And we'll stand you up. So I know he's got the ability to do stuff. That tackle zone, that means he's not going. Maybe we should advertise this on um, uh, some other places. Where could we advertise our giveaway today? To get some more people to come and meet us. And wouldn't it be nice to have new friends? Chat, wouldn't we like new friends? On dice, Glart. No bueno. Be a change. <laughs> Only one of you dead speak as well. Reddit. Yeah. I would like less competition on the giveaway, says it. No. But it is a good shot. Well, I haven't got the time to go and post, but if someone wanted to, um, I'd be very grateful. Advertise it on Pornhub. <laughs> it's not the market we're going for, Baz, but yeah, why not? Reddit doesn't like self-promotion. Well, in that case, I shouldn't, um, I shouldn't promote on Reddit, should I, uh, Chubbers? But one of you lot could. He's going for a 3 plus 3 plus uh, to then run away potato. It's a message on 08, uh, 98, Andy, Andy, Andy. <laughs> oh no, skitty, you useless knob. Look what you've gone and done there. Oh dear, poor skitter. Now, which one do we hate more? Do we hate Skitter for... We're going to claw him to death. Yep, three dice on Skitter, stab stab. Die Skitter. Thanks for playing.
three dice on the goblin. This isn't going to change his mind that all I do is dice him, isn't it? This has not changed his his mind state that my life is very unfair. Hold up. Right, we're going to hand the ball off to Rugbar. Scoring range one, three, four. There we go. We go there. We're leaving this a bit vulnerable because I want to score next turn. <coughs> and he's trying to get us to do the dirty work. Hope you will, Andy. <laughs> Hello, Proud Star. Nice to have you with us today. Um, isn't it nice that there's a lot of you watching um, daytime time? Uh, how, how many of you are actually working at the moment? Hello, Hellboy. Uh, is it open subs only? No, it's inbox. It's it's open for everybody. Uh, nice. How do I enter? Um, <laughs> oh eight nine eight Andy, uh, and then a one I think. Space one I think it is. I'm working. Um, hanging out on Twitch while having some form of nominal workload open. Redshirt and Proudstar both work on a night shift. Bloody hell. Ali is logged on to his work terminal. That sounds like um, very Blade Runner. I am logged into my terminal. I've been here since the start, Andy. I'm going to get the hello now. Hellboy, how are you doing today, by the way, Hellboy? I'm, I am sorry that we haven't spoken more. What are you, what are you doing? How's the PhD going along? Inbox full. I think you have joined. Yes, you have. Uh, for those of you who are unsure what the hell 0898 Andy is, uh, Zunk has decided, rightly or wrongly, um, that I run a special phone chat line uh, for you all to talk to me whenever you want. Um, and Zunk thinks it's hilarious, so that was a nod to the Zunk, really. Rugbot, are you paying attention on the game, by the way? Because we're about to hand you the ball. I would hate for you to just casually drop it. So, do you think you can... I think we can be alright there? Smash this goblin in the face. Whoops. In the face. In fact, I don't think I'm going to hand it off to Rugbar. I think I'm going to give it to the killer. Because the killer would get piling on, and that would change this team up quite a lot. Maybe not. Maybe we can get another touchdown. <laughs> There yeah, you can. Good. It gives me three dice with you. Never away. Made it look like I want to score with us with a with the guy holding the ball. <laughs> Little does. Madness. And off the ball. Rugbart here. Hold on, Rugbart. Let's go. Like the song, oh, uh, I don't know what that one is gonna, but yeah, sure. How do you mean to win a game? How many blitzes has he got left? Oh, he's still got one. Yeah, yeah. What 
What's SM uh, ASMR? What's that? I don't know what that is. But he got. He didn't get skit. Oh, he didn't get skitter back this time. He did get Scarwig. What Scarwig? I think we're just going to go with the same setup, to be honest. Yeah, we'll just go with the same setup. Autonomous Sensor Meridian Hunt. Rifle, do you know what? I am no closer to understanding what that is than I was before I asked. So thanks very much, but I still don't know what that is. What does it do? AMS, uh, okay, that thing you do with A is when you're really good, sensitive mic can breathe quietly down. That's not a thing, surely. Oh, he's gone from having one reroll to three rerolls. <laughs> okay. Sounds delightful. I want to see how he's going to play this game because he's now 2 0 down. What he should be looking to do if he wants a result out of this uh, is bang bang one in quickly um, and then try and play for 2 2. Um, I'm okay with this taking a little while, so that's 2-0, and I scored because I thought that I could maybe take them all off him and score again. Kratos is not scoring. But we've got him to block. So I guess he's trying to keep push, plugging away with Rugbot. Or, and or getting a body opposite skill. Because um, getting Rugbot to guard would then suddenly give me three block guard warriors, and that would change the team up quite a lot. Um, as would a Podiopsis getting mighty uh, piling on. <coughs> so I think he's he's really important to level. He's really important to level. Um, I have got a project player in uh, Logics, but I just can't I afford want that. the Platic Andy D. <laughs> uh, but I can't afford the um, the spare uh, in leveling Logics up. Moment. Uh, Pentacle, thank you very much for your 17 months there. It's amazing that people with Twitch Prime are able to do that, um, and it's lovely you've uh, you've carried it on. Thank you very much. Um, Kinroth says, what's the game plan for fresh under versus fresh chorfs? Chorfs are two balls, six chorf, two rerolls, eight five. Um Don't uh, constantly hit with a mighty blow, mummies if you can, but make sure the blocks are three dice. So um, make yeah, make sure your blocks are three dice. Do not get into a pitch battle with the chorfs because otherwise you will struggle. Um, and if you can, snipe off the hobgoblins because they're more likely to break. But you need to play it as a, you're a running team, do not try and play like you're the strength team. Otherwise that will just get you into... Logics, how you doing? You'll have to, yeah, I, I'd love to level you up, Logics. You are, you're actually quite an important player in this team. But I need to lay the proper foundations first. Are these annoying players in scoring range? Yes, they are. It's got sides that that doesn't have many, many dice. This guy, and I can stand you. There. Okay. Um, I think you're gonna give. I think I'm gonna give myself four dice here. Three. I would love to have moved an extra player in, but I haven't got resources to do it. So, right into there, pushing that scoring ring. Come around the top. There. Wants to throw the ball, that's fine. Touch. 
Oh no, Pyro. Uh, hi, Andy Jacob. Cheeky, yes, it's very much a cheeky daytime stream. Hello, Bella. I hope you're by the way. And um, we have got a giveaway open, so please do join, Veli. Uh, it's 08, uh, exclamation mark, 089A, Andy, um, and then space one. Um, as Mordala, um, Mordala Jin, Jin. Hang on, what? M O R D, Mord, A, E, Game. Fuck me, I could, I could do that all day and not get that. Right. Maud, hello. I wonder how he's going to play this through. Is he going to try and score this turn or not? Um, kind of okay with him scoring next turn because he's got two turns to score back. Um, but we do have to be careful. We have only got eight players, nine players. Um, and he potentially gets one away so he's back. And we, uh, we turn a 2-2 win, 2-0 win into a 2-2 draw. Water guiding. Is that correct? Our vacuum being naughty. No way to welcome a new a new coach. He needs two casualties to level this. What's the giveaway for? Uh, a free Andy Davo and a free Zunk uh, tabletop figure um, from Grebo Games. Oh. Um. Oh, good. Blood Bowl 2 question. Uh, Blood Bowl 3 question. Do I think anyone will take the new stat increases under the new rules? They're very, very expensive. Um, yeah, I suspect so. Yeah, I think you will. I think you'll see people do it. Does the sunk figure come with a kitten? What? And then randomly go for no reason. Ow! Um, yeah, I think it does, yeah. Um, yes, stat increases. I mean, there are certain players. The ones that you'll see and take it regularly are the, are the players that do really well from any stat increase. So, gutter runners. Catchers, war dancers, witch elves, um, all will do really well. Oh, nice proud star. Awesome. Good luck. I hope I genuinely I hope that goes really well for you. That'd be that'd be awesome. He's done well there, actually. That's that's pretty effective. Well done him. Right. Wants to go and stand there. There and here. Oh. Right. Which way am I going to blitz? If I blitz into here, I can get. Right. Go in there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Blitz into that. Hopefully, we'll nail this. Oh. Mario gets to go in. There. Can... Mario goes there. I'll worry about him up. That's kind of going to slow this guy down for a turn. Um, and I get my two stun players back. And if he hasn't scored, we might stand a chance. I think you should. There. There. Mistake. Uh, they're giving out masks in the swag. <laughs> Haha. 
Um, Arcani, if you don't like the stat, you can get this straight. The basic skill is that instead. So if you paste 18 star player points and you didn't like the stat, you're still allowed to take a normal skill, right? Yeah, that was why that was a mistake. I'm going to turn this into a three plus dodge now. Cancelling that assist. Never leave open assists. Big, big no no. Uh, how, Crowdstar, how long is it until um, the Chaos Cup? Yeah. Oh, okay, so not not too far away. Well, he's managed to make this into a three plus dodge, uh, which with a reroll is now likely to happen, and that was my own mistake. I I've let him do this. I shouldn't have let him do this. This is foolish. It's annoying when that happens. What would you take? What's the rule set, Proud Star? Six normals? God well, kind of does the same as AB, but it's better. Yeah, God is just. God is God. God is God mode. Oh, he should score. He should be able to score this turn. Might not. One. When's he going to roll a one on the dodge? Well done. Where's the second head on the throw? It's a really tiny one. You can't see it. I have to zoom in. I think we're going to see the rest of the rulebook released in the PDF format probably over the next two weeks. Um, I also suspect that what they're going to do is they're actually going to allow. Sorry about this. Um, I think we're going to see um, the, the rulebook leaked in its entirety. I think you're going to start seeing fake leaks next. Um, yeah, that's uh, that's going to be a thing. Fake leaks. And then GW will then print, uh, release it properly afterwards. We're at three, six, nine, six. What? Three, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten plays eleven. It's out. There's been a. What, hello, purple chest. How you doing? There's been already one fake leak at least. Uh, is that the chaos roster? I think it's a GW are now they're at the point where um, having a little bit of leakage, um, seepage, we'll call it, um, is is treating them is treating them all right. And the real chaos only gets picked. Have they um? Have they actually? <laughs> Hancock, I'm not responding to that comment. Uh, Star Ferret, you know exactly as well. Uh, all horrible people. Um, we're over here. Oh, three turns to score. I clawed the last again, I think. Good. Uh, proper Chaos roster is out. Uh, does anyone want to link the Proper Chaos roster? Not the one with the stupid little tiny people in it. It's obviously bollocks. Which I know is bollocks. Um, various reasons. Right, if you flop there. Ah oh dear. Shame, I think it's over there. Is that the... Let's have a look at that one. 
Yeah, that's right. This chosen team may take any one of the following. We'll have two dice into two dice, this guy. What am I looking for, Andrew? Really not the block dice you're looking for. Let's there. Uh... We're going to go all one, two, three, four, five, six. Really bad turn. Really bad turn. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, normal team creation, then you get um, 150k for skills and some rules. Last round is fun when you get two free mutations on anything. Fun. That sounds fun. Oh, because it's Chaos Cup, so you want, you want Chaos Mutations. Fair enough. Um, is there no wild animal on mine or is it just a mistake? Uh, it's not wild animal, I think it's supposed to be um, animal rage. Ancient ogre sounds nice. Yeah. Unchallenged fury. Yeah, unchallenged fury. Yeah. Um. Yay, we're gonna get flooded here. Ah, high road. Not to be dead. Flooded here. Very bad. Can't reach, can't reach, can't reach. Uh, I just feel the ogre is better than the other two. Yes. I still would like Troll Slayer with Claw. For the last game, that sounds quite entertaining. I'll be back in just one second. I would like to roll one million two pluses. <sighs> actually rolled one million two pluses as well.
Have we just managed to turn this into a loss? Two, three, five, six. Um, I don't think we're viably scoring. Three. Scoring. I'm not prepared to throw the three plus. Ten four. Blitz. Rude. Okay, go for it one. Do not. Do not. Should have handed this off, actually. I should have gone. Go for it one. Walk forward. Hand off ball. That was a mistake. That was a horrible mistake. Because you could have been there. Then I could have had the ball. I could have had the ball there. Guarded there. Yep. Steak. Steak and half, wasn't it? At least to see old Smugly there is, uh... Bloody bathroom running. Got two dice here. This is this is my own silly fault for not covering this properly. You got away with that. Got away with that. Didn't didn't do that last turn very well at all. Got away with it. Saved by the dice. Yes, and it's nice, nice to be saved by the dice because a lot of the time I get screwed by them. So nice, nice to be saved. And always find the Lord. Ah. Yeah. Hello, Hotek. I've, so I think maybe our remote should just be pictures. Oh, he's going to be a bell end. Yay! Really? No dice. I, I, I like the idea that there are no dice, but in reality there are dice. Um, but I think the, the, the truth is the middle ground, isn't it, Hellboy? Which is that there are some dice, and you need to just not um, not get hung up on the dice cost you the result. Um, Look. 
a literal statement of philosophy. Yeah. Fair enough. Right. Um. Can I get three dice? Oh. Yeah, we should we should get three dice on this. Throw the ball with this. Oh, actually, I think I'd rather have three dice with. Right, we'll blitz that. I'll play points on him. Would have been nice. Push away. Stay put. I uh, don't actually want star player points on the goat. I'd rather have more warrior, so I'll add an extra three plus in. Dude. Never mind. Up the belly getting a revenge foul. Nah. Nah. No revenge foul. Uh, where did the MVP go? Ah, oh, finally, Kratos has leveled. And the MVP finally went on a warrior. Seems to have a little bit better again. Russell Storm, get the guard. Kratos has. So looking at the team now, we are on 13-3-0, which is fine. Um, and this team is he's not very far away now from, I wouldn't say greatness, but effectiveness, I think. Uh, two guard warriors gives me a little bit of a guard platform. I need to get him up to guard, and we need to get him onto uh, to piling on. But after that, once we've got those two players leveled, we then need to press on with Rugbart, get him up to guard, and we need to develop a second killer. Um, once we've got those things in place, we can then look at Logics, the Beastman, start pushing some points into him. It would be a lovely, but unfortunately he's a bit of a project player and we can't afford to play uh, project playing now. 